eggs in England. They don't have eggs? Yeah, there's like a huge eggs shortage in England right now. What the fuck? And there's going to be a grain shortage like Q1 next year. Uh, in like a big UK or here? Everywhere. Everywhere. Interesting. Because Ukraine was a, was a big exporter of grain. Right. And Russia was too. And because everyone's like, like, screwing with everyone, then there's no grain being exported. Interesting. I think yeah. Ukraine's like the second biggest. I think they are. They're like, yeah. So. They're big producers. Which I never knew until Russia attacked them. Like, I never knew how much they made. Like how much shit they produced. Yeah. It's pretty wild. Yeah. I couldn't imagine not having eggs, though. How are you supposed to get your gains? I don't know. How do you get gains How am I supposed about to eat eggs? All my egg whites? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, exactly. I feel like we could... There's other things that make eggs, though. There's, like, bird's eggs and whale <laughs> eggs and people. ostrich Platypus. eggs. Platypus. People. There's people eggs, you know? Big Daddy's like, honey, let me see your tampon. I scope it out. Daddy needs his protein. That would be... I think I'd, I think I'd drink breast milk before I stoop to that level. I would hope so. I would really hope so. I saw a TikTok yesterday where it was like a, uh, a parody. Um, uh, like You know like when people go out and interview people on the street? Like ask them a question yeah. or whatever. They were doing that. I forget what the exact question was, but... Um, Everyone would just answer, I just like going home and drinking my mom's sweet, creamy breast milk. <laughs> it was just everyone saying that. <laughs> it was so funny. Uh, there's like a couple that came up and the, the girl was like, yeah, you know, I take him home, take him over to his mom's and she, he just, you know, sucks down his mom's uh, sweet, creamy breast milk. Yeah. Makes him big and strong. He loves it. And I was like, oh, all right. Yeah. That's that sucks, dude. Uh, UK, uh, big L. So the, do they just not have chickens, or like what? What's going on here? I mean, I don't know who the I don't know who the big exporter of eggs are. Who, <laughs> who's see. the big egg exporter? It there's a line here that says that egg producers have been hit with huge hikes in production costs. Feeding hens is now at least fifty percent more expensive than it was, and energy prices have soared in the same way. Wow. Uh, yeah, I knew their energy prices are like kind of fucked. Yeah, but, I can imagine. Well, did they get? Um, they didn't get. Well, they do get some energy from Russia, or they used to, right? They got natural gas from Russia. Yeah. Yeah. yeah now, now they don't. Yeah. Dude, that shit's they, wild. Germany's just like, yeah, you're you're gonna not have a, like heat this winter. That sucks, but nothing. We yeah. Can do about it, I'm like, um, that's crazy. Okay. Well, it's because they, they knocked down all of their nuclear facilities and all that, so mm -hmm. they couldn't produce any energy. Because nuclear and, is scary. Well, now now they're going to pollute more because, like, fire-burning fuel sources are much dirtier for the environment than uh, everything else. Yep. It's really funny. That seems like pretty common sense, right? Uh, apparently not. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. But fire cool. Fire make me happy. Fire fire me, cool. Me yes. like fire. I don't know if you saw the Bjorn Longberg thing with Rogan. Uh no, I haven't watched it yet. He was like he was like Yeah, they did this study on uh like in England against um to see how much emissions reach into like an apartment that's next to a road. Mm hmm And and what they found was the spikes in like in pollution within the apartment spiked only when the the neighboring apartment lit a candle on fire. Whoa, really? Huh. That's what that's what he said. I haven't looked into the study. What but, the fuck? That doesn't yeah. seem that. I don't know. I, I don't know about that. Really? Well, like like current methods of of automobile efficiency, I mm -hmm. guess, um, has, like, greatly outpaced what it was. So it's, like... Yeah. It, like, obviously, it doesn't burn, like, clean, but it definitely burns cleaner than, you know, fire. Interesting. Yep. 
I because guess we can sense. we can use it more efficiently. I think it's like like we get I, I think it's like fifty percent or sixty percent of the energy out of the, mm-hmm. the gasoline. Whereas you get like less than that, way less than that in terms of the fire. Oh um, yeah, yeah. It's like Huh. Whatever. All right, so I should stop lighting my candles is what I'm taking from this. Lighting candles is going to destroy the environment. It's bad. Candle bad. What if that was? A, what if that becomes a thing? Candles are bad for the environment. You can't light your Yankee, uh, Yankee Doodle candle companies anymore. No, we won't allow it. And we'll get like hybrid candles, energy efficient yes. candles. Energy efficient candles. That'd be cool. It's just kerosene. Big Daddy, that could be you. It's just you're the candle gasoline. guy. <laughs> Pioneer uh, yeah. energy efficient candles. That'd be it's brilliant. It's literally a battery. You light on fire. Mm-hmm. <laughs> nuclear, just using nuclear candles, right? <laughs> that sounds like a go- the government goal. in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> but back to the eggs. This is crazy. There's a line here. I went to my local Sainsbury yesterday. There was not a single box of eggs on the shelf. What the fuck? Yeah, like, that would be... Can you imagine what that no. would be like in America? Like, I mean, I don't know that we've ever seen anything like that. At least, you know, not in our lifetimes, definitely. But, like, not being able to find eggs? Do, like, British people consume more eggs, though? Like, I'm... No, you know, like, no. It's, I it's doubt all it. because of the it's all because of the costs of like one delivering two keeping the and two keeping the chickens healthy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 I get that. But like, I mean, if eggs disappeared off the grocery store shelves, I I think I'd be okay. You know, I I mean, I wouldn't enjoy it, but I think I could I could get protein from other sources. You well, know? yeah, but you would you would be like, damn, there's no fucking eggs. Yeah, you know. Yeah, like it's like, breakfast. It, it wouldn't be like you wouldn't die. But think about the be breakfast. Like, no fucking eggs. Breakfast. Think about the brunch. Breakfast. Think about brunch. dude. Taco Thank Bell you. breakfast with no eggs, non-existent. That'd it's be true. bad. There's, I mean, you couldn't have cakes. There's a lot of stuff that's made with eggs. That's so what I'm saying. Say like tough. pancakes, waffles, uh, bacon, egg, and cheese McGriddle. That's gone. Can't do that. I'm just. This is what. This is what the Brits get for not refrigerating their eggs. Oh, I forgot that they do that. That's fucking weird. That makes me not feel as bad for them. Makes me not feel bad for them. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. Uh, Wow. Well, all right. Um, UK. (laughs) Get fucked. I don't know what to tell you. (laughs) What? what, They're going to start eating like platypus eggs or some shit. (laughs) 